Police Services right here in shoot number four. Donnie Grant opening the gate. Donnie, that's a nice belt buckle. Belts will pick up girls, I know. I'm trying to figure out how I became the Gimlet Rodeo all-round cowboy. They give a new meaning to the term all around out there, don't they? Well, there's two of you guys standing here looking dumb. These will be three of us. Oh, yes, our bullfighters right there. Ryan Johns in the red. The Dickies Bullriders. We have got Matt Chen in the white blue. Come on, Cowboy, you got it. Look at that. to make it here. I think he was competing down. Were you, uh, Jordan, were you at Vulcan earlier today? I think he was at Vulcan. He made it down here tonight. Hey, he's in Didsbury. All right, he made it. Good job, Jordan. We're looking to our judges. Our pickup man over there doing what they do best. Wayne Powell, Mark Robinson. Thank you. Richards Rustock. Doug Richards. Thank you, Doug, for giving us the bucket horses, the bucket bulls. We're talking about our bullfighters down there. Right here, the black hat, the lighter blue shirt. That is Matt Chin, Corrections Canada, Armed Forces. He is here. The big guy in the red, he looks like he is a traffic cone. That is Ryan Jones. And over there in the barrel, my new ex-best friend, Ed. That is Daryl Robinson. Man, 69 for Jordan, 69. Who's up next? Peter Smith Lawson won himself a belt buckle last night. Looking to do it again. This is brought to you by the Delta Hotels. This is bull riding. All right, we're there. Shoot the football. Peter Smith Lawson, new to the Calgary Police Service, brand new to bull riding. He won himself a buckle last night. Thank you to Richard Needlands for helping out back there. Joe Messina, that's it. Oh, there we go. Look at that. All right, Peter, good job, Cowboys. Oh, nice job, nice job, Peter. Oh, yeah. You saw about 18 inches of air between his backside of his Wranglers and the back of that bull. Peter, you had two good rides yesterday, another ride today. You are hooked on this, aren't you? Man, that's a big old bull, isn't yeah, it? That is a big old bull. Hey, speaking of big... <laughs> I don't know if I want to go there or not. It, you know how you get 100 cows into one barn? How do you get 100 cows into one barn, Bill? You put up a big, huge neon bingo sign. <laughs> 56 points for Peter, 56. Hey, Rod, if you get hired somewhere next week, next yes. year on this weekend, yes, I'll be available to you. <laughs> Jose Simmons, Calgary Police Service, last year, did it on a dare. Walked in here, had nothing. I think he was wearing Reebok sneakers and a baseball hat on backwards. Somebody slapped him and said, son, put that baseball hat on straight and you're gonna go buck some bulls. And the rest is history. There's actually video of him on YouTube doing this. Really? Yes, there is. Jose Zivas, Calgary Police Service. He's originally from England. So he's appreciating the fair food here because you know what? They do not know how to cook over there, do they? <laughs> okay, Jose. Okay, Jose. Jose. All right, shoot number six, Jose Zivas. Oh, yeah. Did it on a dare last year. How did the guy from England get a Mexican name? Uh, you know, I was actually wondering the same thing last year. I asked the question and still not received an answer. You know what they say? They're not Mexican? <laughs> hey, we're not Oh, he's Spanish. That's why. So how does a, a guy from England get a Spanish name? <laughs> Yeah. You're confusing, you know. <laughs> he doesn't take much. <laughs> no. 
All right, we got it down there. Jose Simmons, Calgary Police Services. Did it on a dare last year, he's doing it again this year. Hey, tonight we're going to be bucking bulls, the whole Johansson Brothers. Second annual invitation here tonight. World Professional Bull Riding. You stick around, you'll be here. This is going to be a whole bunch of fun. Gary, are you coming back? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not quite sure yet. <laughs> I know, I wanted to say things sometimes. Uh, my agent is in negotiations right now as we speak. And how is your son doing with this? Well, uh, he's got me up to $3. So. <laughs> Jose, Jose, we should have kept you as a Mexican. You want to stay home.